Evening all, how you doing? I hope you're well. Now, my shoes have finally fallen apart. Well, these uh, pump 2.0s, these auto pumps. So I thought I'd show you the uh, inner workings of it, the pump technology. But yeah, I had them on for a few hours yesterday and they, they finally caved. Just seems to be on this side though, but it is what it is. They are about 20 years old now. But yeah, I've took the insoles out. I'm going to keep the insoles because, uh, well, they're actually in uh, really good nick. Better than I thought they'd be. Unbelievable, really. They look brand new. Yeah, you've seen these before. I've showed you them before. But there you go. I mean, I'll just show you what it looks like in the shoe because I've took the other one apart properly. Focus. There you go. That's your auto pump. And here. It is in all its glory. Just swap hands. Really good uh, pump mechanism. Amazing, really. I was going to give it a clean, but I thought oh, I've said it. I mean, I don't know if I'll throw it in the bin or keep it with the others. I'm not sure. Yeah, pumps up really, uh, really thickly. And I didn't realise that it came down to the front of the shoe as well. Because that would be here, around here. I mean, obviously, it feels like it, there's more of a pump on the inside of the shoe. I mean, when you strip it back, it don't look much. But uh, it definitely feels like it when the shoe's on. Yeah, 2001, 2002, I think this pair came out. I think that's when we first saw the uh, the auto pumps. Or the 2.0s, as it was called. Show you where that right. Like so there's no different PSI settings on this, like there is the uh, the Iverson 10, although that came out in 2005, so the technology had obviously uh, got a bit better by then. So it obviously sends the air and it splits into these two little channels here and into the shoe. Although I don't know why it's split into two channels when it goes into one. That's a bit bizarre. This is just to get it in there quicker. I'm not sure. But yeah, that's it. I thought I'd make a quick video for you. Just show you it. I say the shoes are ruined, but I always like to take the technology out of the shoes if I can, especially with uh, Reebok pumps and IKEA's stuff like that. So it's always nice to see the inner workings. So yeah, that'll do. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm out.